One of the four suspects faces charges in a high profile murder case from 2022. Megan Western is at Barrington Hall. That's in West Bibb County to recap the case and what we know about one of the suspects. Megan. Good evening, Frank and Lori. Yes, this is Barrington Hall neighborhood where 52 year old Joey Fournier murdered his ex girlfriend. Cynthia Barry. Now the Bibb County Sheriff's Office says in early 2022, Fournier allegedly strangled the victim to death. The victim's family told us she moved into the place to get away from Fournier. Barry filed a protective order against him in 2021. You may remember this story because of the night of the murder. Bibb County dispatchers didn't send a deputy until 14 minutes after the 911 call was made. The Sheriff's Office says it took them at least 27 minutes to respond. That's why Barry's own brother found her body inside the home instead of deputies. Investigators say after the murder, Fournier got his brother to drive him to Rome in northwest Georgia. That's where he was arrested the day after Barry's death. Live in Macon, Megan Western 13 WMAZ News. Back to you. Thank you, Megan. The other escaped inmates, 24 year old Mark Anderson. He's being held or has been held since January of 2021, charged with three aggravated assault charges. 37 year old Jennifer Barnwell was held by the U.S. Marshal's Office. A federal jury in Macon this month convicted him of trafficking large amounts of fentanyl, methamphetamine, heroin, cocaine, and cocaine base. He was also convicted on a gun charge. He faces a sentence of life in prison without parole. And 29-year-old Chavis Stokes was being held since May of 2022. He faces more than two dozen charges, including drug trafficking, hit and run, obstructing officers, and possession of a firearm. He was arrested in May of 2022. Also on his file with the jail, he's accused of giving inmates alcohol, drugs, phones or weapons without the warden's consent. As the search continues, the sheriff's office does need help. Sheriff Davis said within the past hour, they do want to know who was driving this car, the blue Dodge Charger, and they want to speak with either the driver or the owner. They're asking for anyone with information to call one of three numbers. Obviously, the Macon Regional Crime Stoppers number you're familiar with, 1-877-68-CRIME. They also have two tip lines. The first one is 478-310-4485. The second tip line is 478-310-4052.